Okay, hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then hi. My name is Malaysia and I am a first time mom of a now 18 month old. Now this haul is going to be a mixture of thrifted items and items from Shein. And the first thing is actually on my daughter right now. And it's this really cute Disney Mickey Mouse two piece set. I actually got this from the thrift store for like $3 and it's adorable. It comes with biker shorts, or in my opinion, biker capris, and then this cute little um, tool shirt, and it's just adorable. The first dress that we have is from Shein. I hope you guys can see that. It's just this white tool um, daisy dress. I think this is adorable. I got a bunch of these little thin onesies. I think these are perfect for summer. If they had of fit her right, this one I think was a little too short and it just kind of fit her weird. So at the top here, um, the back is just like way way down but it's a cute idea if it had a fit right these are like three dollars on shein which is really super easy and cute to style the next thing we have here is wasn't my favorite item i actually thought it was going to be pajamas but it came in two different fabrics so we're probably going to send this to grand grand so that way she can have some clothes over there in case she needs to change but it's just this purple shirt it's just this purple butterfly shirt and for some reason the pants are these purple leopard print pants again not my favorite choice that i've gotten but I'm gonna keep it at Grand Grand so I don't have to see it in her in her closet here. This is one of the thrifted sets and it's just this peplum tank top with these super cute striped pants. The back is out. It's just this little um, kind of like crisscross pattern. It's really, really cute. Although it is in the 24 months, but I think that she should be able to fit them even if it's a little bit, if the pants are a little bit big on her. This next set is from Shein and this is a little cute little yellow set that says bring good luck. So it came with this t-shirt and this pair of shorts. One thing about their sets is the bottoms tend to fit much bigger than the tops. So the top is probably spot on and the bottoms will fit looser than they are supposed to, but gives her room to grow into them and shorts are very easily mix and matched. We have this super cute tool dress here. So it has this flower print and then the tool at the bottom. I love puffy dresses like this on her. I think it's super adorable. And then the print with the white bottom is very cute and spring. The next dress that we have is this purple dress. This dress actually has a little pocket for a stuffed animal, but she took the stuffed animal out and has been playing with it, but it's still a really cute, simple dress. The next dress we have is this pink dress. All of these dresses have been washed and tested. Um, if you do need tester items to test for the lead um, in Shein clothes, because there has been um studies that some of their clothes are high in lead i'll leave a link to some lead testers on amazon you can get them in a bulk pack and then just test the clothes when they come send back anything that test is really really high um i haven't had that problem this dress right here has this little really cute like i don't know what you'll call it crisscross or cinching in the middle and I actually ordered a dress just like this for myself so that we can be matching I thought it was super cute here we have another dress this one just has butterflies on it and it's pink it's really cute and simple I got another dress I think summer for both of us is the time of dresses especially um, I wanted to make sure she had plenty of dresses for church but I got her this dress it's just a pink striped with strawberries and I thought it was really cute does have a little keyhole in the back this next dress is a red rainbow collared dress I thought this was really cute and it does come in different colors but I think with the rainbow it looked better with red because the rainbow has red in it as far as accessories goes I got her a ton of accessories um, I did get her two pack of little bows from Shein and then from Amazon I actually ordered some bigger bows and then also from Shein I got her a bunch of ponytail holders but 
they're all over the place so who even knows at this point okay back to the thrift store for a second i got her this super cute little set so this set says dream 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 and it came with this like school styled skirt so it has shorts underneath i thought this was super adorable it was 18 months and i believe i got the set together for like three dollars at the thrift store another thrifted item is this super cute um printed dress i sent this picture to my husband and he was like oh that looks like a um african print dress so that's why i got it it says it's from an indian boutique i thought it was really cute it is 12 months but it does stretch a lot she actually has worn it once already with a black shirt and black tights underneath in the winter time so I can't wait for her to be able to wear this during the summer. I did also get her a couple of shoes from the thrift store. I went a, like literally on Saturday afternoon right before Easter because she needed some shoes to go with her Easter dress. So these are the shoes I picked up for that. They are just these flats. I don't even know where they're from. I paid $3.50 for them for these little cute crisscross flats and surprisingly they fit her. She has really fat feet so it's kind of hard to find shoes that will fit her lengthwise and chubbiness wise so I was glad that I was able to find those I also picked up these shoes these are from Rachel's shoes I paid six dollars and fifty cents for them and her feet are too fat for them I have seen a couple of tricks though oh but I even noticed that that's coming apart so we're probably going to return these shoes if I can find the receipt which is right here lucky for me and then another pair of sandals that just barely fit her i think that her problem with these sandals are because her foot is fat at the top up here um these just barely made it so but they're still comfortable on her like i can fit my finger through um when she's standing up but they're just these cute shoes that have rainbow on the side i thought they were super adorable um and they were only 450 so i got her some sandals these are these are all just starter shoes she'll probably get more shoes as we get deeper into the warmer days but i can't find the other one right now who knows oh found it so these are the last pair of sandals i got her and these fit her the best in fact they're a little bit big so they fit her the best out of all of the ones that she's had these might have came from Shein I'm not really sure I paid three dollars for them and I think they're really cute I did get her three of these sets so these are just these like little heartbeat white shirts with different colored what do you call that stitching at the ends i got her three different ones so we have the blue one a pink one and a brown one and of course they came with matching shorts to go with the colors on the shirts so i thought that was super adorable and for five dollars you cannot miss an easy play outfit um, I'm going to show you guys this shirt that I also picked up at the thrift store. It was a set. It came with a butterfly biker shorts and I can't find them anywhere. They're probably in the dirty clothes. But I thought it was super cute. And again, their spring and summer sets at Once Upon a Child have been like 3 to $4 for like biker shorts and a cute like tank. And I just love it so much. I did get her a pack of biker shorts from Shein, but I would definitely, 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 definitely say just get them at the thrift store at Once Upon a Child or order a big pack or order a big pack at Amazon because they don't fit right. They don't fit like biker shorts. And for $10, I could have literally took that $10 to the thrift store and got about 10 pairs of biker shorts. So I got three in a pack and this is what they look like. They actually look like they should a little bit fit better, but they fit very, very, very loose. Got a couple more pairs of those like onesies. This is a shorts version with a little butterfly. She loves the color purple, so that's why I got more items in purple than pink. Well, I guess not really more items than pink, but I got a couple more purple items than I normally would because I like her. Like she likes them. Also, the shorts version of those fit much better than the pants version, and it's really really cute. 
my personal favorite is this material right here so this one is more of like a clothy material this is the typical like material of like she normally gives um i do like this better in this style just because it stretches very well this one stretches very well too but it doesn't hold its stretch so even though this one is stretching it still stays put together and keeps everything in place and I just really like it so we have a plain pink one and then the butterfly one um, I'll probably order some more once we get deeper into summer we do have another long purple one which is probably just gonna go to grandma's because she doesn't have to change her clothes often but in case she does um, I try to keep items over there that I won't miss at the house. So the last item that we have is this really cute romper. This is from Shein. Um, I'm not sure how it's going to fit on her specifically. Sometimes I have a problem with these type of tops from Shein just because they don't fit in the correct spots that you want them to, especially if you have a tall baby. But I thought this was super cute. It was only $5. I could not pass that up. And that brings us to the end of our video. I actually have some food that smells like it's done. So I'm going to go ahead and go and thank you guys so much for watching this video. It would mean the most to me if you give this video a huge thumbs up. Share it with a friend who also loves clothing hauls and hit that subscribe button because I have a clothing haul for myself coming. So if you're a mama looking for spring and summer outfit ideas, I will definitely have a video like that coming soon. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. P.S. Don't forget to follow me on TikTok for message Mondays. I posted a message this morning on the day that I'm filming this and that message was that protecting your peace might not be allowing you to be as Christ-like as you want to be. You'll have to head over to my TikTok to see more about that. Bye guys.